miracles reviving dreams Romans chapter 4 and verse 17 as it is written I have made you a father of many nations in the presence of him whom he believed God who gives life to the dead and calls those things which do not exist as though they did God supernaturally miraculously revives dreams that we've given up as dead think about Abraham and Sarah think about when they got married there must have been so much excitement anticipation expectation uh, they must have had huge dreams of having a family and having children of their own and and all of that but time had gone a lot of time had elapsed and they had no children they discovered Sarah was barren from her youth and here they were uh, 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 well, they had well advanced in years and suddenly God comes in on the scene but who is this God he is the God who gives life to the dead he is the God who awakens and brings to life dead dreams he is the God who causes the dry bones to uh, have come form, form come back in formation together and come alive now, he is the God who brings the Lazarus out of the grave he's the God who revives dreams that we've given up and uh, buried and just let go he revives them again he is a God who works such miracles are uh, to revive such dreams so are there dreams that you've buried and you said well that's a dream I'm just gonna give up it'll never happen in my life are there things that you would like to have but don't exist now and it seems impossible for them ever to come into your life Abraham and Sarah had a dream they had a they probably had a dream and they've probably given it up and here comes God and he says you're gonna have a son and you are gonna have a nation come out of you and God fulfilled it he brought into existence what did not exist and God does such things for you and me we must believe God believe that he's a God who gives life to the dead and he's the God who brings into being what does not exist he is the God of miracles he is the God who made heaven and earth and for whom nothing is impossible as we close out this week here I'm praying for miracles today I want to pray for the miraculous reviving of dreams for the miraculous bringing in of things that do not exist let's pray together and I want you to expect these things to take place and I believe they will let's pray father we thank you that you are the God who gives life to the dead and you're the God who brings into being what does not exist so in Jesus name let dreams be revived and let dreams come to pass Lord give them supernatural signs that you are reviving dreams in their lives you're doing what does not what is impossible and Lord that you will bring into being what does not exist for them so release miracles for your people I pray in Jesus name Amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.